the tragic murder of one of ancient Greece's earliest mathematician. In the ancient city of Alexandria, there lived a remarkable woman named Hypatia. Born around 355 AD, she was a shining star in the sky of knowledge, a beacon of wisdom in a time of great turbulence. Hypatia was more than just a woman of her era. She was a mathematician, an astronomer, and a philosopher, roles typically reserved for men. But Hypatia fearlessly embraced these fields, breaking barriers and paving the way for future generations of women in academia. Growing up in Alexandria, Hypatia was fortunate to have a father, Theon, who was also a scholar. Under his guidance, she delved into the depths of mathematics, astronomy and philosophy, eagerly absorbing knowledge like a sponge soaking up water. Her thirst for understanding was insatiable and she quickly became known for her sharp intellect and keen insights. As she blossomed into adulthood, Hypatia's reputation as a brilliant teacher and thinker spread far and wide. Students from all corners of the ancient world flocked to her doorstep, eager to learn from the wise woman of Alexandria. Among her pupils were young men who would later become influential figures in their own right, inspired by her wisdom and guidance. Hypatia's contributions to mathematics and astronomy were groundbreaking. She made significant advancements in geometry, developing new methods and theorems that are still studied today. Her astronomical observations helped refine our understanding of the cosmos, laying the groundwork for future discoveries. But Hypatia's brilliance also made her a target. In the tumultuous times of religious strife, her outspoken views and independence clashed with the growing power of the Christian Church. Despite Hypatia's dedication to knowledge and her peaceful nature, she found herself caught in the crosshairs of political and religious turmoil. In the early 5th century AD, Alexandria was a powder keg of tension with religious factions vying for power and influence. Hypatia's open-mindedness and rational approach to philosophy clashed with the growing influence of the Christian Church, which sought to suppress dissenting voices and enforce religious orthodoxy. Her close association with prominent pagans and intellectuals further painted a target on her back. The situation reached a boiling point in 415 AD when a wave of anti-pagan sentiment swept through Alexandria. In the midst of this fervor, Hypatia became a convenient scapegoat for those seeking to consolidate power and eliminate opposition. A Christian mob fueled by religious zeal and inflamed by rumors and false accusations descended upon Hypatia with violence in their hearts. Despite her pleas for reason and understanding, she was subjected to a brutal and senseless attack. Her assailants, blinded by ignorance and driven by fanaticism, showed no mercy. They dragged Hypatia from her home, tearing at her flesh with savage ferocity. Her cries for help fell on deaf ears as the mob's fury consumed her. Hypatia's tragic death sent shockwaves through the intellectual community, not only in Alexandria, but across the ancient world. It was a stark reminder of the dangers faced by those who dared to challenge the status quo, of the fragility of enlightenment in the face of ignorance and intolerance. Her murder cast a long shadow over Alexandria, staining its streets with the blood of one of its brightest minds. And there you have it, the tragic tale of the ancient Greek mathematician Hypatia. For more content like this, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe to Chrono Tales.